Right, three sessions of cleaning and I can't take it anymore. So we've got 18 tiles there, plus the four ones that have slight issues at the back, plus two half tiles. I need three per row here and I can get to somewhere around there. And I don't trust myself at all measuring stuff. So I've got this, which I'm going to put up against the wall here. And funnily enough, that is the same amount of distance as we've got over here. So it should look uniform. Right, so I've marked down here and along all the way along here. I've made it ugly to make sure that I don't go wrong because I don't want to see it. So let's see how we get on. As you can see, I immediately run into problems because if I go by what I measured, it's going to encroach in that. And I tried it this way around as well. And then I've got to make sure they overlap like that. That doesn't look right. So we're going to have to already go wrong by about that much. And then you've got a gap between the two, which looks better. So as long as you don't go up here and look, oh, look, oh, <laughs> should be all right. Hooray, that's a big moment for me, seeing something up on that wall. Now, I already told you that, uh, so I mismeasured there. Then I didn't figure on the fact that when I'm pushing from standing on the floor, I can't see the line and the glue had already gone on. And as soon as it's on there, you're stuck. So I could play with it a bit as we carefully move up on a chair here. Uh, can you see? Yes, it's slightly below. It's not quite right, but it's not far off. God, I knew something would go wrong with that first tile. So that's where we're at. So we'll maybe slightly adjust as we go down and hope to get it right on the next set of tiles. Actually, I was sufficiently worried about this. That I'm going to go and do the next tile next to it. Uh, I don't know if you can see from there, but I've marked out down here and along here where it should go. Let's see if we can rectify things. It's only slightly out, but once you start sloping down, oh boy. Right, what I've done is I've slightly lowered it here. So hopefully I'm more in line going down the wall there. A slight error. And unfortunately, it seems to have pulled in a bit there. Uh, what can you do? In the meantime, I've identified a number of more uh, tiles that should be okay. The cleaning is irrelevant. It's just, is the tile in good shape? You know, no bends and stuff. So yeah, we're looking good for putting good tiles in this room and perhaps the seconds in the back bedroom. And she has a search amongst the debris here to find any more good tiles. It becomes clear my three minutes per tile estimate goes out the window when you've got additional measuring considerations. I don't think there are any more good ones, but uh, we'll hunt. Ah, there's a gap down there. And I moved this across, but I've actually damaged the uh, foam there in trying to do so. <sighs> and you can see the pen marks. So that's definitely lunch then. I uh, shall have a cup of tea or vodka and uh, sort out what to do next. Row number three. Four. Five. And that's the sixth row. So let's just um, sort of walk in here and start talking. Oh, yes, you can hear it already, can't you? Drawing the sound in. How beautiful is that? Yeah. So we haven't done down here yet. We haven't put any soft covering on the floor, probably put a rug or something like that there. And we've got this to do. And of course, it's reflecting off the doors and windows at the moment. But yeah, you can hear it in here, can't you? Just oh, just here, just kill it, kills the sound. Isn't that beautiful? So it's two o'clock in the afternoon and I'm about to run out of the first can of glue and we have stuck this much on. So you would think I'd finish that wall these would be no problem. I would think I'll get through about two and a half cans of glue, which would be perfect, because then I'll have one and a half left to do the back bedroom. Now, can you hear the sound here, look, echoing around? And then as I walk in towards this corner, I'll keep talking to you. Listen to the change in the sound. Oh, ho, ho, ho. fantastic. Some joy then here at scififunk.com. That didn't go too bad, actually. I've cleaned nine more. So that's three rows to go up. We've done the six rows 
and there'll be five more rows. So we should get to about here uh, in a minute or two. And that is row eight. And that, my friends, is the ninth row. It's about uh, 20 to four and I'm knackered. So we've got two rows to go. I think I'll have a cup of coffee. Let's just walk into the sound of, well, it's not really silence, but deadening. Ah, lovely. So we've got these to put up, but let us have some coffee. <laughs> 